Phenols, Wikipedia article audio. In organic chemistry, phenols, sometimes called phenolics, are a class of chemical compounds consisting of a hydroxyl group bonded directly to an aromatic hydrocarbon group. The simplest of the class is phenol, which is also called carbolic acid C, 6H, 5O. Phenolic compounds are classified as simple phenols or polyphenols based on the number of phenol units in the molecule. Classification Synonyms are aranols or aryl alcohols. Phenolic compounds are synthesized industrially, they also are produced by plants and microorganisms, with variation between and within species. Hybrid chemical classes Although similar to alcohols, phenols have unique properties and are not classified as alcohols. They have higher acidities due to the aromatic ring's tight coupling with the oxygen and a relatively loose bond between the oxygen and hydrogen. The acidity of the hydroxyl group in phenols is commonly intermediate between that of aliphatic alcohols and carboxylic acids. Chemistry Loss of a hydrogen cation from the hydroxyl group of a phenol forms a corresponding negative phenolate ion or phenoxide ion, and the corresponding salts are called phenolates or phenoxides, although the term aryl oxides is preferred according to the IUPAC Gold Book. Phenols can have two or more hydroxy groups bonded to the aromatic ring in the same molecule. The simplest examples are the three benzene diols, each having two hydroxy groups on a benzene ring. Chemical Properties Organisms that synthesize phenolic compounds do so in response to ecological pressures such as pathogen and insect attack, UV radiation, and wounding. As they are present in food consumed in human diets and in plants used in traditional medicine of several cultures, their role in human health and disease is a subject of research. 104 Some phenols are germicidal and are used in formulating disinfectants. Others possess estrogenic or endocrine disrupting activity. UV Visible Absorbance there are various classification schemes, 2A commonly used scheme is based on the number of carbons and was devised by Jeffrey Harborn and Simmons in 1964 and published in 1982. Oxidation Not in this Harborn classification are the C6C7C6 diural heptanoids. They can also be classified on the basis of their number of phenol groups. They can therefore be called simple phenols or monophenols, with only one phenolic group, or D, tri, and oligophenols, with two, three or several phenolic groups respectively. Phenolic compounds Naturally occurring Synthetic Drugs, present, and past. The largest and best studied natural phenols are the flavonoids, which include several thousand compounds, among them the flavonols, flavones, flavin 3OL, flavonants, anthocyanidins, and isoflavonoids. The phenolic unit can be found dimerized or further polymerized creating a new class of polyphenol. For example, ellogic acid is a dimer of gallic acid and forms the class of elogotannins, or a catechin and a gallocatechin can combine to form the red compound theoflavin, a process that also results in the large class of brown therabigins in tea. Two natural phenols from two different categories, for instance a flavonoid and a lignin, can combine to form a hybrid class like the flavonolignans. Nomenclature of polymers Plants in the genus Humulus and cannabis produce terpenophenolic metabolites, compounds that are meroterpenes. 
Phenolic lipids are long aliphatic chains bonded to a phenolic moiety. The majority of these compounds are soluble molecules but the smaller molecules can be volatiles. Many natural phenols present chirality within their molecule. An example of such molecules is catechin. Cavicularin is an unusual macrocycle because it was the first compound isolated from nature displaying optical activity due to the presence of planar chirality and axial chirality. Natural phenols chemically interact with many other substances. Stacking, a chemical property of molecules with aromaticity, is seen occurring between phenolic molecules. When studied in mass spectrometry, phenols easily form adduct ions with halogens. They can also interact with the food matrices or with different forms of silica or silica-based sole gels. Natural phenols spectral data show a typical UV absorbance characteristic of benzene aromaticity at 270 nm. However, according to Woodward's rules, bathochromic shifts often also happen suggesting the presence of delocalized pi electrons arising from a conjugation between the benzene and vinyls groups. By an ester rearrangement in the Fry's rearrangement, by a rearrangement of N-phenyl hydroxylamines in the Bamberger rearrangement, by hydrolysis of phenolic esters or ethers, by reduction of quinone S, by replacement of an aromatic amine by an hydroxyl group with water and sodium bisulfide in the Butchera reaction, by hydrolysis of diazonium salts, by oligomerization with formaldehyde and base catalyzed reaction with epichlorohydrin to epoxy resin components, by reaction with acetone slash ketones to e.g. bisphenol A, an important monomer for resins, e.g. polycarbonate, epoxy resins, by a rearrangement reaction of diene ones in the dienone phenol rearrangement. As molecules with higher conjugation levels undergo this bathochromic shift phenomenon, a part of the visible spectrum is absorbed. The wavelengths left in the process recompose the color of the particular substance. Acylation with cyanamic acids of anthocyanidins shifted color tonality to purple. Here is a series of UV visible spectra of molecules classified from left to right according to their conjugation level. The absorbance pattern responsible for the red color of anthocyanins may be complementary to that of green chlorophyll in photosynthetically active tissues such as young Quercus coxifera leaves. Natural phenols are reactive species toward oxidation notably the complex mixture of phenolics, found in food for example, can undergo autoxidation during the aging process. Simple natural phenols can lead to the formation of B-type procyanidins in wines or in model solutions. This is correlated to the non-enzymatic browning color change characteristic of this process. This phenomenon can be observed in foods like carrot purees. Browning associated with oxidation of phenolic compounds has also been given as the cause of cells death in cali formed in in vitro cultures. Those phenolics originate both from explant tissues and from explant secretions. The majority of these compounds are soluble molecules but the smaller molecules can be volatile. Phenols often have chiral centers. An example of such a molecule is catechin. Cavicularin is an unusual macrocycle because it was the first compound isolated from nature displaying optical isomeric activity due to the presence of planar chirality and axial chirality. Phenols chemically interact with many other substances. Stacking, a chemical property of molecules with aromaticity, is seen occurring between phenolic molecules. When studied in mass spectrometry, phenols easily form adduct ions with halogens. 
They can also interact with the food matrices or with different forms of silica or silica-based soul gels. Phenols are reactive species toward oxidation, notably the complex mixture of phenolics, found in food for example, can undergo autoxidation during the aging process. Simple natural phenols can lead to the formation of B-type procyanidins in wines or in model solutions. This is correlated to the non-enzymatic browning color change characteristic of this process. This phenomenon can be observed in foods like carrot purees. Phenolics are formed by three different biosynthetic pathways the shikimate slash mate or succinyl benzoate pathway, which produces the phenylpropanoid derivatives, the acetate slash malonate or polyketide pathway, which produces the side chain elongated phenylpropanoids, including the large group of flavonoids and some quinones, and the acetate slash mevalonate pathway, which produces the aromatic terpenoids mostly monoterpenes, by dehydrogenation reactions. The aromatic amino acid phenylalanine, synthesized in the shikimic acid pathway, is the common precursor of phenol containing amino acids and phenolic compounds. In plants, the phenolic units are esterified or methylated and are submitted to conjugation, which means that the natural phenols are mostly found in the glycoside form instead of the aglycone form. In olive oil, tyrosol forms esters with fatty acids. In rye, alkyl resorcinols are phenolic lipids. Some acetylations involve terpenes like geraniol. Those molecules are called meroterpenes. Methylations can occur by the formation of an ether bond on hydroxyl groups forming omethylated polyphenols. In the case of the omethylated flavone tangeritin, all of the five hydroxyls are methylated, leaving no free hydroxyls of the phenol group. Methylations can also occur on directly on a carbon of the benzene ring like in the case of poriol, a C-methylated flavonoid. Chemical Properties 2 Several Laboratory Methods for the Synthesis of Phenols Phenols react in a wide variety of ways. The white rot fungus Phanerochete chrysosporium can remove up to 80% of phenolic compounds from coking waste water. Phenols are important raw materials and additives for industrial purposes in Tannins are used in the tanning industry. Some natural phenols can be used as biopesticides. Furanoflavonoids like carangin or rotenoids are used as acaricide or insecticide. Enological tannins are important elements in the flavor of wine. Biosynthesis Some phenols are sold as dietary supplements. Phenols have been investigated as drugs. For instance, crofloumer is a drug under development for the treatment of diarrhea associated with anti-HIV drugs. Additionally, derivatives have been made of phenolic compound, comritastid in A4, an anti-cancer molecule including nitrogen or halogens atoms to increase the efficacy of the treatment. Synthesis of phenols Reactions of phenols Esterification reactions and ether formation, electrophilic aromatic substitutions as the hydroxyl group is activating, for example synthesis of calyx arins, reaction of naphtals and hydrazines and sodium bisulfide in the butcherer carbazole synthesis, oxidative cleavage for instance cleavage of 1,2-dihydroxybenzene to the monomethylester of 2,4-hexadenodiwaic acid with oxygen, copper chloride and pyridine, oxidative de-aromatization to quinones also known as the tuber reaction. Oxidizing reagents are freemis salt and oxone. 
in reaction depicted below 3,4,5 trimethylphenol reacts with singlet oxygen generated from oxone slash sodium carbonate in an acetonitrile slash water mixture to a paraperoxyquinol. This hydroperoxide is reduced to the quinol with sodium thiosulfate. Laboratory Processes, Chemical Industry, Chemical Engineering Processes, Wood Processing, Plastics Processing Biodegradation Applications Industrial Processing and Analysis Phenol extraction is a processing technology used to prepare phenols as raw materials, compounds, or additives for industrial wood processing and for chemical industries. Phenol extraction Extraction can be performed using different solvents. There is a risk that polyphenol oxidase degrades the phenolic content of the sample therefore there is a need to use PPO inhibitors like potassium dithionite or to perform experiment using liquid nitrogen or to boil the sample for a few seconds to inactivate the enzyme. Further fractionation of the extract can be achieved using solid phase extraction columns, and may lead to isolation of individual compounds. The recovery of natural phenols from biomass residue is part of biorefining. Separation PKA of phenolic compounds can be calculated from the retention time in liquid chromatography. Studies on evaluating antioxidant capacity can use electrochemical methods. Analytical methods Detection can be made by recombinant luminescent bacterial sensors. Phenolic profiling can be achieved with liquid chromatography mass spectrometry. Profiling A method for phenolic content quantification is volumetric titration. An oxidizing agent, permanganate, is used to oxidize known concentrations of a standard solution producing a standard curve. The content of the unknown phenols is then expressed as equivalence of the appropriate standard. Some methods for quantification of total phenolic content are based on colorimetric measurements. Total phenols can be measured using the folin siocolturda reaction. Results are typically expressed as gallic acid equivalents. Ferric chloride test is also a colorimetric assay. Quantification La Maison and Carnet have designed a test for the determination of the total flavonoid content of a sample. After proper mixing of the sample and the reagent, the mixture is incubated for 10 minutes at ambient temperature and the absorbance of the solution is read at 440 nm. Flavonoid content is expressed in mg g of quercetin. Quantitation results produced by the means of diode array detector coupled HPLC are generally given as relative rather than absolute values as there is a lack of commercially available standards for every phenolic molecules. The technique can also be coupled with mass spectrometry for more precise molecule identification. Antioxidant Effect Assessment Other tests measure the antioxidant capacity of a fraction. Some make use of the 2,2 as an obis radical cation, which is reactive towards most antioxidants including phenolics, thiols, and vitamin C. During this reaction, the blue apse radical cation is converted back to its colorless neutral form. The reaction may be monitored spectrophotometrically. This assay is often referred to as the Trilox equivalent antioxidant capacity assay. The reactivity of the various antioxidants tested are compared to that of Trilox, which is a vitamin E analog. Other antioxidant capacity assays that use Trilox as a standard include the diphenylpicryl hydrazyl, oxygen radical absorbance capacity, 
ferric reducing ability of plasma assays or inhibition of copper catalyzed in vitro human low density lipoprotein oxidation. A cellular antioxidant activity assay also exists. Dichlorofluorescin is a probe that is trapped within cells and is easily oxidized to fluorescent dichlorofluorescein. The method measures the ability of compounds to prevent the formation of DCF by 2,2 azobes dihydrochloride generated peroxyl radicals in human hepatocarcinoma HEPG2 cells. Genetic Analysis other methods include butylated hydroxytoluene, butylated hydroxyaniseli, ransomat method. Natural occurrences Larvae of the model animal Galleria melonella, also called waxworms, can be used to test the antioxidant effect of individual molecules using boric acid in food to induce induced and oxidative stress. The content of malondialdehyde, an oxidative stress indicator, and activities of the antioxidant enzymes superoxide dismutase, catalase, glutathione S transferase, and glutathione peroxidase can be monitored. A prophenol oxidase can also be recovered from the insect. The phenolic biosynthetic and metabolic pathways and enzymes can be studied by mean of transgenesis of genes. The Arabidopsis regulatory gene for production of anthocyanin pigment 1 can be expressed in other plant species. Occurrences in prokaryotes Phenols are found in the natural world, especially in the plant kingdom. Oroval can be found in Streptomyces neyagawaensis. Phenolic compounds can be found in the Cyanobacterium arthrospirum maxima, used in the dietary supplement, spirulina. The three Cyanobacteria microcystis aeruginosa, Cylindrospermopsis raciborski, and Oscillatoria sp are the subject of research into the natural production of butylated hydroxytoluene an antioxidant, food additive and industrial chemical. The proteobacterium Pseudomonas fluorescens produces fluoroglucinol, fluoroglucinol carboxylic acid and diacetyl fluoroglucinol. Another example of phenolics produced in proteobacteria is 3,5-dihydroxy-4-isopropyl trans stilbene a bacterial stilbenoid produced in photorabdus bacterial symbionts of heterorabditis nematodes. Phenolic acids can be found in mushroom basidiomycetes species. For example, protocateca wic acid and pyrocatechol are found in Agaricus bisporus as well as other phenylated substances like phenylacetic and phenylpyruvic acids. Other compounds like atramentin and thelophoric acid can also be isolated from fungi in the agaricomycetes class. Orobol, an isoflavone, can be isolated from Aspergillus niger. Aromatic alcohols are produced by the yeast Candida albicans. They are also found in beer. These molecules are quorum-sensing compounds for Saccharomyces cerevisiae. Aryl alcohol dehydrogenase uses an aromatic alcohol and NADN to produce an aromatic aldehyde, NADH, and H+. Aryl alcohol dehydrogenase uses an aromatic alcohol and NADPN to produce an aromatic aldehyde, NADF, and H+. Aryl dialkyl phosphatase uses an aryl diacyl phosphate and H2O to produce diacyl phosphate and an aryl alcohol. Gyrophoric acid, adipside, and orsinol are found in lichen. The green alga Botryococcus brownii is the subject of research into the natural production of butylated hydroxytoluene, an antioxidant, food additive, and industrial chemical. Phenolic acids such as protocateca wick, p-hydroxybenzoic, 2,3-dihydroxybenzoic, chlorogenic, vanillic, caffeic, 
P. cumeric and salicylic acid, cinnamic acid, and hydroxybenzaldehydes such as P. hydroxybenzaldehyde, 3, 4 dihydroxybenzaldehyde, vanillin have been isolated from in vitro culture of the freshwater green alga Spongiochlorus spongiosa. Occurrences in fungi Fluorotannins, for instance echel, are found in brown algae. Vidalin alone can be found in the tropical red alga Vidalia sp. Occurrences in lichen Phenolic compounds are mostly found in vascular plants i.e. lycopodiophyta, pteridophyta, angiosperms, and gymnosperms. Occurrence in algae In ferns, compounds such as camphorol and its glucoside can be isolated from the methanolic extract of fronds of Phagopterus connectiles or camphorol 3 orudinoside a known bitter-tasting flavonoid glycoside can be isolated from the rhizomes of Selagia fei. Hypogallic acid, caffeic acid, paenivlorin, and picuroside can be isolated from the freshwater fern Salvinia molesta. Occurrence in land plants In conifers, phenolics are stored in polyphenolic parenchyma cells, a tissue abundant in the phloem of all conifers. Occurrences in vascular plants Occurrences in monocotyledons Occurrences in nonvascular plants Occurrences in other eukaryotes Occurrences in insects Occurrences in mammals Roles the aquatic plant Myriophyllum spicatum produces elagic, gallic, and pyrogallic acids and catechin. Alkyl resorcinols can be found in cereals. 2,4 bisphenol is a phenolic compound found in the orchids Gastrotia elata and Galeola fabri. Phenolics can also be found in nonvascular land plants. Dihydrostilbenoids and bis can be found in liverworts, for instance, the macrocycles Cavicularin and Ricardin C. Though lignin is absent in mosses and hornworts, some phenolics can be found in those two taxa. For instance, rosmarinic acid and a rosmarinic acid 3O beta D glucoside can be found in the hornwort Anthocerus agrestes. The hardening of the protein component of insect cuticle has been shown to be due to the tanning action of an agent produced by oxidation of a phenolic substance forming sclerotin. In the analogous hardening of the cockroach Oatheca, the phenolic substance concerned is 3,4-dihydroxybenzoic acid. Acetosaringon is produced by the male leaf-footed bug and used in its communication system. Guayacol is produced in the gut of desert locusts, Schistocerca gregaria, by the breakdown of plant material. This process is undertaken by the gut bacterium Pantoa agglomerans. Guayacol is one of the main components of the pheromones that cause locust swarming. Orsinol has been detected in the toxic glue of the ant species Camponotus saundersi. Rhinchophorus ferruginus use 2-methoxy-4-vinyl phenol for chemical signaling. Other simple and complex phenols can be found in eusocial ants as components of venom. In female elephants, the two compounds 3-ethylphenol and 2-ethyl-4,5-dimethylphenol have been detected in urine samples. Temporal glands secretion examination showed the presence of phenol. M. cresol and P. cresol during must in male elephants. P. cresol and O. cresol are also components of the human sweat. P. cresol is also a major component in pig odor. 4 ethylphenol, 1, 2 dihydroxybenzene, 3-hydroxyacetophenone, 4 methyl 1, 2 dihydroxybenzene, 4 methoxyacetophenone. 5-methoxy salicylic acid, salicylaldehyde, 
and 3-hydroxybenzoic acid are components of castoreum, the exudate from the castor sacs of the mature North American beaver and the European beaver, used in perfumery. In some cases of natural phenols, they are present in vegetative foliage to discourage herbivory, such as in the case of western poison oak. In soils, it is assumed that larger amounts of phenols are released from decomposing plant litter rather than from through fall in any natural plant community. Decomposition of dead plant material causes complex organic compounds to be slowly oxidized lignin-like humus or to break down into simpler forms, which are further transformed into microbial biomass or are reorganized, and further oxidized, into humic assemblages, which bind to clay minerals and metal hydroxides. There has been a long debate about the ability of plants to uptake humic substances from their root systems and to metabolize them. There is now a consensus about how humus plays a hormonal role rather than simply a nutritional role in plant physiology. In the soil, soluble phenols face four different fates. They might be degraded and mineralized as a carbon source by heterotrophic microorganisms they can be transformed into insoluble and recalcitrant humic substances by polymerization and condensation reactions, they might adsorb to clay minerals or form chelates with aluminium or iron ions, or they might remain in dissolved form, leached by percolating water, and finally leave the ecosystem as part of dissolved organic carbon. Leaching is the process by which cations such as iron and aluminum, as well as organic matter are removed from the litter fall and transported downward into the soil below. This process is known as podzolization and is particularly intense in boreal and cool temperate forests that are mainly constituted by coniferous pines whose litter fall is rich in phenolic compounds and fulvic acid. Phenolic compounds can act as protective agents, inhibitors, natural animal toxicants and pesticides against invading organisms, i.e. herbivores, nematodes, phytophagous insects, and fungal and bacterial pathogens. The scent and pigmentation conferred by other phenolics can attract symbiotic microbes, pollinators, and animals that disperse fruits. Volatile phenolic compounds are found in plant resin where they may attract benefactors such as parasitoids or predators of the herbivores that attack the plant. In the kelp species Alaria marginata, phenolics act as chemical defense against herbivores. In tropical sargassum and turbinaria species that are often preferentially consumed by herbivorous fishes and echinoids, there is a relatively low level of phenolics and tannins. Marine allele chemicals generally are present in greater quantity and diversity in tropical than in temperate regions. Marine algal phenolics have been reported as an apparent exception to this biogeographic trend. High phenolic concentrations occur in brown algae species from both temperate and tropical regions indicating that latitude alone is not a reasonable predictor of plant phenolic concentrations. In Vitus vinifera grape, trans, resveratrol is a phytoalexin produced against the growth of fungal pathogens such as Botrytis cinerea and Delta viniferin is another grape vine phytoalexin produced following fungal infection by Plasmapara viticola. Pinosilvin is a pre-infectious stilbenoid toxin, contrary to phytoalexins, which are synthesized during infection. It is present in the heartwood of Panaceae. It is a fungi toxin protecting the wood from fungal infection. Saccharanidin is a flavonun, a type of flavonoid. It can be found in Polymnia fruticosa and rice where it acts as a phytoalexin against spore germination of Pyricularia oryzae. In sorghum, the SBF3H2 gene, encoding a flavonoid 3-hydroxylase, 
seems to be expressed in pathogen-specific 3-deoxyanthocyanide and phytoalexin synthesis, for example in sorghum colitotrichum interactions. 6-methoxymelin is a dihydroisocumarin and a phytoalexin induced in carrot slices by UVC, that allows resistance to Botrytis cinerea and other microorganisms. Danilone is a phytoalexin found in the papaya fruit. This compound showed high antifungal activity against Colitotrichum glosporioides, a pathogenic fungus of papaya. Still beans are produced in eucalyptus sideroxylin in case of pathogens attacks. Such compounds can be implied in the hypersensitive response of plants. High levels of phenolics in some woods can explain their natural preservation against rot. In plants, vera is a protein histidine kinase which senses certain sugars and phenolic compounds. These compounds are typically found from wounded plants, and as a result vera is used by agrobacterium tumefaciens to locate potential host organisms for infection. Natural phenols can be involved in allelopathic interactions, for example in soil or in water. Juglone is an example of such a molecule inhibiting the growth of other plant species around walnut trees. The aquatic vascular plant Myriophyllum spicatum produces elogic, gallic, and pyrogallic acids and, catechin, allelopathic phenolic compounds inhibiting the growth of blue-green alga Microcystis aeruginosa. Phenolics, and in particular flavonoids and isoflavonoids, may be involved in endomycorrhizae formation. Acetosaringon has been best known for its involvement in plant pathogen recognition, especially its role as a signal attracting and transforming unique, oncogenic bacteria in genus Agrobacterium. The vera gene on the TI plasmid in the genome of Agrobacterium tumefaciens and Agrobacterium rhizogens is used by these soil bacteria to infect plants via its encoding for a receptor for acetosaringon and other phenolic phytochemicals exuded by plant wounds. This compound also allows higher transformation efficiency in plants, in atomophacians mediated transformation procedures, and so is of importance in plant biotechnology. Notable sources of natural phenols in human nutrition include berries, tea, beer, olive oil, chocolate, or cocoa, coffee, pomegranates, popcorn, yerba mate, fruits and fruit-based drinks and vegetables. Herbs and spices, nuts, and algae are also potentially significant for supplying certain natural phenols. Natural phenols can also be found in fatty matrices like olive oil. Unfiltered olive oil has the higher levels of phenols, or polar phenols that form a complex phenol protein complex. Phenolic compounds, when used in beverages, such as prune juice, have been shown to be helpful in the color and sensory components, such as alleviating bitterness. Some advocates for organic farming claim that organically grown potatoes, oranges, and leaf vegetables have more phenolic compounds and these may provide antioxidant protection against heart disease and cancer. However evidence on substantial differences between organic food and conventional food is insufficient to make claims that organic food is safer or more healthy than conventional food. In animals and humans, after ingestion, natural phenols become part of the xenobiotic metabolism. In subsequent phase 2 reactions, these activated metabolites are conjugated with charged species such as glutathione, sulfate, glycine, or glucuronic acid. These reactions are catalyzed by a large group of broad specificity transferases. UGT1A6 is a human gene encoding a phenol UDP glucuronosyl transferase active on simple phenols. 
The enzyme encoded by the gene UGT1A8 has glucuronidase activity with many substrates including coumarins, anthraquinones, and flavones. Role in soils Role in survival Defense against predators Defense against infection Role in allelopathic interactions Content in human food Human metabolism Books Databases <laughs>